Hey guys, what is up? And I'm going to show you how to install the Bucket Plugin Ultimate Arena. So, first off, you're going to scroll down here and download this. All the links will be in the description, like always. So, just download this. And if it does not come in a zip file, then I'll show you how to get the files that you're supposed to get if it is not in a zip file and just a dot jar. So, drag it to your desktop. Go back here. If you do not get a zip, you will have to go back here. There should be a link right here. You're going to click on that. Download. Say OK. Drag this to here. And then X out. Okay, so after that, we're going to go to your bucket server in here. And then drag the dot jar into your plugins folder. And then run the server. And it says fail to load all this configuration. Well, I'll show you how to fix it. So you're going to do stop. Go to your plugins. And inside this, you're going to go in here and there's just these two files. And uh, you're going to open up this thing that you just downloaded, the zip. Go to here. And then copy everything like all the files and then just drag it right here so it's pretty much that simple and then exile this and then run your server one more time and there you go everything should be fine so after that I'm gonna get in the game and show you how to set it up and this works really well with um, PvP gun plus so you can turn into a call of duty server. Okay, so I'm inside. I'm gonna change my game over fast. Oh wait, there we go. Okay. So, so I'm gonna show you how to set up um, a arena type. Uh, other arena types will be in separate videos that you can see on my channel. But I'm just gonna do a random one. So I think I'm gonna do today uh, captured flag. Okay, so I'm going to go somewhere where it will be easy to build. Uh, at least I got spawned by a rocky mountain. Okay, right here should be fine. So I'm going to stand right here. I'm just going to cheat and use world edit so then it will go super fast. So, so spawned. And it turned into a gun. Okay, I had that texture back. Okay. So, click here, go all the way up here, and you don't have to zone the area so then people grief, you don't have to do that because once they join the game, they can't grief at all, not unless you give them a special permission, so don't have to worry about that. So, slash, slash, So now I'm going to show you how to set this thing up. Alright, so first off, you're going to do in my inventory. You're going to go here. Alright, so first say UA create, and then your arena name that they're going to join. So I'm going to just say test. And then the arena type, and on the website there's different arena types, so I'm going to say CTF. Enter. Okay, so now you have to do the lobby, which is the zone of the lobby. So since I did not create a lobby, I'm just going to go to a random place and do it. So I'm going to click here, UASP, and I'm going to go up here, UASP, UA done. It's really simple to set up because uh, there's only like two commands that you have to really use. So that's what I like about this plugin. And then now we have to do the arena. So I'm going to go down here. Do UASD. I'm going to go all the way up here.
then do you a ton. Okay, so after you set up the arena, now you're going to do the lobby spawn. Red team will be where you get spawned by the classes before the game begins. Classes is like uh, what you're going to be spawned with, like archer, kit, or different different uh, classes that you can set up. And it's really simple to do signs. I'll do it in a separate video. So you're going to make sure it's inside the zone that you made of your lobby. So I'm going to do ASP. It's okay if the blue and red is connected to each other. So now you have to do the arena spawn points. So red team will spawn here. Make sure it has uh, more room above because you need a lot of room above because sometimes they spawn like way up here and it messes up. So you're going to go down here. Do UASP. UA done. Okay, so after that you have flags, spawn points, which you have to set up so it doesn't tell you which one is first but it's red that is first so just remember that it's red so I'm going to put the red flag right here and then the blue will be down here and then you ain't done so it's that simple and now your friends can play you have to have at least two people otherwise it may mess up so you slash UA join test or whatever your uh, other arena is. So it's actually pretty simple. And then later in my separate videos, I'm going to show you how to create where the player will be spawned here and he can pick a class to begin in. So I hope you enjoy this video and there will be separate videos that you can watch of different arena types. Thanks for watching.